Kurtus Pirates. Pirates are kind of sucky though. It's a Quillbor lobby. Kurtus Quillbor? Pigamot Quillbor. Kurtus is still good in a pirate lobby because if you hit Gambler, you can hit your hero power. That's like the reason why you want Kurtus hit pirates, not necessarily to play pirates. Let's go Kurtus. His hero power can be super good. Yeah, his hero power is super good because it can give you like a duplicate of a minion that you want. Finish, play Battlecry, play whatever faster. Congrats on 14k. Well played last game. How is the coffee? Asking the best question last. Coffee's good. I already had two. I should uh, chill down a bit. You don't want to like down the coffees. I want to drink coffee the Italian style. Like coffee and now some water. Italian way would be an espresso. I mean, I drank my coffee straight, but it wasn't a pure espresso. It was an espresso with some water. But it wasn't enough water to call it an Americano. I think it's just long espresso. Is long espresso a European Americano? Yes. Ozymandias, thank you for the 11 months. And Moha, thank you for the 15 months. It wasn't a double espresso. Yes. It was only one, and then with a bit of water. I love that there's like a Italian name for like every single style of coffee. It's kind of funny. Yes. McNuggets, thank you for the three years. I see you said a quick pay. Three years of kick W's. Nobi man, thank you for the sub. Feel, yeah, the difference between a long espresso and an Americano, I think. Americano, they just take hot water from outside. Long espresso, you just, you just like espresso it more. Sounds right? Why am I, am I stupid? You extract it longer, yeah. Is there a word for microwaved coffee? Stupid. Or however you say that in Italian. Show them your wrath. Not sure if we're gonna take a tie here. Ah, one off. I might want to level here. 45 attack by 12. Hmm. By 12, 45 attack and 8 spells. I like Wisdom Ball. How difficult it is 45 attack? Shouldn't be that hard, right? Yes. Why not Temporal and 4 Squillboard? Why not Wisdom Ball and then still 4 Squillboard? By 12 is too much. The nude dude, thank you for the four months. Huh? Yeah, I think it's Wisdom Ball. I'll catch you next. Oh, a Why not spells? I mean, spells is super easy to do, but is it better than the ball? Long term. No, it's a short term quest. I mean, we could spells. go for that. And then try to make sixes. And then use hero power to copy the sixes. Yeah, maybe accelerator is more is better. Hmm. Because it was like so easy to complete. How do you feel, friend? Do we ever go oil? Oil and then go crazy? I'm not the biggest oil enthusiast, but level and attack undead is also a good way to finish the quest. I was never thinking of the attack undead. I was thinking of bacon and sell the bacon as the other option. But maybe attack undead is better. Hmm. Show them your wrath.
Okay. Okay, with Gambler we can definitely do things. Be sure you have sufficient forces on your side. Okay, we might finish the quest. We can't finish next turn, right? Why taunt it? Because I want to go big. So we need to cut Refiner and get some extra attack. We're going to 41 with the 6 attack instead of the Refinery. This battle has not yet been decided. Yeah, I'm trying to do some math in my head. This guy also pretty strong, eh? Ah, stupid Refiner didn't give me any gold. Low lul. Yeah, at least we killed the bongo bopper. I still believe The fuck? Even small forces can fight well. I want to see if I got our phalanx. What's the best pick for us? I like your odds. Phalanx, right? Double phalanx. Okay. We can easily get born Phalanx with the Mummifier. Double Phalanx on Tavern Freeze is illegal in 10 countries. Question is, where do we go from here? We need to go to 4 and find the guy that eats an undead, so we can eat the Mummifier. And then we go for KT, I guess. We go places. First places. The Blessing buffs my entire board, but I'll skip. I think we just take a 5. Is a bad idea? Do you just go spore bat and take a six? Okay, let's go bad. Let's go bad, let's go bad. Why are you asking us? I mean, I'm trying to discuss some plays. I'm trying to sit together with you guys. What's the best line? Was the most interesting line. You guys think that I'm so strong that I can open with bat and still win the fight? Probably, I'm fighting somebody who died on turn 7. I don't expect that guy to be a powerhouse. Are you doing interactive fun content? Yeah, better than Netflix. Can you imagine if like this team would be kind of like an interactive... Uh, like, like so interactive that I would only drink water when you guys order me to? I would only go to the bathroom if I'm allowed? In how much time do you think I would die? If Twitch, if Twitch chat would control every single element of my life. It would be funny to see. 
There is strength within you yet. Drink water, see? Somebody get him hydration? Now I'm gonna just be a good boy and drink some water. Can I stop? What if Chad doesn't allow me to stop? I have to like just keep gulping. Drink more? Okay. Pretty fair. That was a sight to behold, friend. Enjoy your reward. Charlie Warpwing. Warpwing is quite good. Good dragon to buff generally. Now you change positionings. Next time we just roll on five. We're trying to triple. We're trying to find the guy that eats an undead so we can eat the mummifier and give reborn to the phalanx. And then we want to get KT. And at some point you want to have this is your only quill board. Buki has to go. But how do you generate gems after Buki goes? I guess you just keep some gems in your hand. Or you try to triple the tough task, but that's expensive. Can't you just scare up the phalanx? That would be easier, yes. That would be a lot easier. But if I'm not offered Scarab, Mummy Fire is the next best thing. Yeah, I was I was I was talking about scratching myself like this, and Chad is like, wait, can't you just go like this? Yes I can't wait, Chad. You're so smart. And I'm not always the brightest. That was a coin flip on the loss. At least we got armor. We took five, we get five. I do so enjoy working along. Slammer can be pretty good with this quest, but I think I'll skip it. Wow. I like the Herald. Do we just pivot to beasts? That one will turn the time. We are nothing without our allies. Oh my god. Three's the magic number. Jesus. The only question is if we are beasts or not. If we are beasts, this is the play. If we are not beasts, I think you sell the wolf and the horse and the tough task to buy the KT, KT the mummy fire to give reborn to phalanx, and then next time triple the phalanx, summon another phalanx. That's such a play. Yes. Lolly Ricks, thank you for the seven months. But, I don't know, we are Kurtrus with Wisdom Ball and Beasts, I feel like we could do something more powerful. It feels like we are way too strong to just play Phalanx. Which kind of sucks, because Phalanx is cool. How do you play Wisdom Ball with Beasts? I mean, you just wait to get copy board and then you win the game. Wisdom Ball is like the best quest in the game to play Beast. Your power all like, it's illegal. I'll skip the KT. Play down the wolf and start rolling. And then roll some more. Slama is good. Ready, That one will turn the tide. Yep. Whatever you think is best. 
This will protect you. Yep. There's the charm. Yep. I mean, beasts are out of this world with Wisdom Ball. Next time I get Golden uh, Slammer with uh, Shield and I even have a chance to duplicate it. It's Jover. Now I just need Titus and Taunton Wolf and it's over. I'm not happy with this win, guys. I'm not happy with this game. I would have liked to play Motley Keltuzad. Fucking beasts are too good. I had to make the pivot. But don't get me wrong, I'm not happy. I will make the pivot, I will win the game, but I'm not happy. I would have liked to play Phalanx. Sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do. Efficient and effective. I feel you, my man. I'm losing all my games because I just want to be happy. This is how it starts and then you're just a slave of the MMR. Exactly, right? I should have said no to beasts. And yes to doing what I want. MMR slave got you, boss. Yeah, but beasts are too are, are too good, I think, right now. I need Titus now. Uh, what did my opponent play? He also played something that I would want, right? I'll buy Tortolan just for if I lose a fight. Oh, okay. OFC. I'm selling the golden uh, phalanx like it's nothing. Next time I want to level and try to find 2020 for the Titus. No need to do anything crazy here, right? I can taunt the bird, but I'm afraid of people switching to Illidan hero power. It's really annoying if they do. Taunt the horse? I don't know about that, but I'm a little bit afraid of the horse having divine shield and not dying. Efficient and effective. Efficient and effective. Okay. I was like, proceed. I still don't have the beast that you're holding in the hand. Am I crazy or do beasts just beat Quillboard in most instances? I played the Quillboard game and I lost to beasts. I played the beast game and I won. I'm playing another beast game and I'm winning. We need to win the mirror match, so I'm playing double Titus on the board. 
they are if your opponent's name isn't Jeff. Is Jeff the Quillboard Daddy? Which footballer would you be? You tell me, chat. You tell me who would I be. Crank Joe, thank you for the free months. Ibrahimovic. I'll take that, okay? I'll take it as a compliment. Although I think that's more fitting to JJ. Even if we lose here, as long as we don't die, we're good. I got 11 percent but it's fine. Didn't down the horse. Taunting the horse seems like a kind of stupid play. We got this shot. Okay. Cascade triples. And now I want to roll with this board because maybe I get copy of board. Another Scarab is really nice. Sometimes I want to buy Taunted Feathermane. Necessary. Taunted Feathermane is better than Reborn Feathermane. No cap. Sometimes change is necessary. Not even sure if I want Sporebat on the board, it's too tiny. No reborn on the horse. You don't usually need that. Overkill. My guy is Dragon, so I don't think he's gonna play the Pirate Snipe. Sporebat was three spells, he kills it, start of combat. Wait, how does he kill it? He changed Hero Power to Lich King. Efficient and effective. Oh no. Is he gonna snipe my Titus? He probably is. Hope I attack first. Wait, why did he snipe my Titus? Oh, it was coin flip, right? Because he could also kill the other minion. Thankfully. And I won the flip. That card is so bad. Like, it's so much worse than Zap. It's kind of funny because we all thought in the beginning that it's better than Zap. And, like, it's just worse than Zap. Zap at least would kill Titus. Some of the time. I don't want to buy it without Taunt. I kind of like Divine for Titus. Divine Titus protects it. This turn looks stupid, but I don't think it was. We did a lot of housekeeping. 
We divine the Titus and we got a lot of income for next turn. Also got a bit of armor. What's the best pickup? Tripling the wolf. Second gift horse. Another slammo. This is what we want. And another taunted feather main. But I'm not buying the free gold taunt. Too expensive. An astounding development. Did they change the taunt card so you can do it in the shop? Oh yeah, you couldn't even do it even if you wanted to. Chat is right. Okay. The odds are in my favor. The odds are in my favor. The odds are in my favor. Want a peanut, Nanas? Even small forces can fight well. Is the minion pool just depleted from beasts? Or like, what the fuck is going on? Should I ever just town the gift horse? Like, seriously? Probably not. I'm scared already of Sindorai. If you're trying to lose taunted. Hey! I could steal the gems and Titus still remained 2020. Yeah, it's turn 16 and I just... I'm not able to find more wolves... More bananas or more horses? Something is weird, Jay. I see you set a quick pace. This guy's board doesn't have wolf at all either. Who's hoarding all the wolves? Is it Brukan? He had golden wolf last time we fought, so maybe. I knew it. Okay, let's beat this guy. Take the top two, and then. We would also want to buy Morazon for the banana, right? You said you will win this game and then be sad. What happens if you actually lose? Don't jinx it. This is fine. This is so fine. This is the most fine. I really like the Featherman we found. It's actually solid. I kind of agree with the rule that if you're strong, don't buy Featherman without Taunt. It's just not worth it. Because it's not making you that much stronger long term. But Taunted Featherman is so good. Taunted Featherman is just a jewel of the beast boards. What is strong in this patch after quests? Morlocks, Beasts, Quillbore. Those are the three dominating tribes in the meta game. Okay. Even to an aspect. Give me the big banana. No. Do you ever just play another Titus or is that low key ridiculous? It's kind of like another Goldring, but it's gonna get sniped by his guy. XQN says in chat, Taunted. Is Taunting Titus like an XQN approved play? <laughs> Is it ever Matador? 
Mm. I think Matador might also be okay. You're missing one horse anyway. I probably just down. I probably just roll. You want second stamina really fucking bad. Okay, I'll buy Matador. Divine Shield Matador is kind of like so stupid that it might work out. I'm freezing for one horse. I think it's horse and stuff. An astounding development. This is basically to mess with his Sindler and shit, you know? Could have bought my own. Fuck. Okay, that's bad. What the fuck is he doing with that pirate, though? Wow, he he dodged the tu the turbo hit. Are we still just winning? Dude, I'm so much bigger than him. It's not even fair, like, look at him. Little bro is tiny. I sniped his banana, that's why, yeah. He sniped my Titus, though, like... What the fuck are we talking about? Yes! Give me the dog! Give me the big dog! Do I just Vigilante myself? To kill his banana? I think beetles are bad here. It messes your reborn. Let me think. Should we give him Matador one attack? Also, how, how bad is the beetle spell? I think it depends. Swatting insects. He's gonna go crazy. The aspects I, I, was mo I was gonna move it. I just moved last second. Dude, the guy still sniped my Titus. How does he know? What the fucker? Ah, I hate it when that happens. Outplayed. Is it outplayed if I still win? He outpositioned me. But I wouldn't really say outplayed. I still got him where I want him. If you know what I mean. Okay, bye. I don't need Titus, friend. I got raw muscle. I don't think he was sniping. Like, I changed last second. I had it position 6 and then I changed last second. I think he just tried to predict that I'm gonna change. It was just like a mind game. But yeah, it doesn't matter. We won. Not sure if Worgen and Matador were that good, but if it worked, it fucking worked. Lol.